the police officers, the EMS technicians and firefighters went to the residence. And what we found was an explosion had occurred inside the residence. There were two people that had been injured. One of those persons uh, has died of their injuries. Uh, we believe this person to be a 17 year old male. Uh, the other was an adult female who was transported to a local hospital with what we believe to be non-life-threatening injuries. What we understand at this point is that early this morning, one of the residents went out front and there was a package on the front doorstep. They brought that package inside the residence and as they opened that package, both victims were in the kitchen and the package exploded, causing the injuries that resulted in the young man's death and the injuries to the adult female. This uh, incident is being investigated right now by the Austin Police Department's Homicide Division as a homicide. What you see behind us is a very that was on the doorstep. What we can tell you right now is the United States Postal Service has reviewed their records and that we do not believe that this was at all a delivery that came through the Postal Service and we're checking with our other package delivery services as well but the initial indication from them is that this was not a package that was delivered by any mail service uh, so it uh, was placed on the front doorstep very early on in the investigation there are similarities that we cannot rule out that these two incidents are in fact related so with that they are related exist and that's what you see behind us is a very concerted effort between all of the agencies you see represented here today because we are not going to tolerate this in Austin and you have seen every stop will be pulled out and the federal agencies have all jumped in with us to lend us a hand and to bring this to as quick of a resolution as possible um, so we will uh,